Okay, it is um, Monday night and I'm trying to make dinner and we're also, I just realized I'm burning this. And I'm also trying to watch Tatum on our little security camera over here. So per usual, I was totally wrong. <laughs> Fern's not delivering first, Tatum is delivering first. So she's getting close, I'm just about to head out there but I've got to get dinner finished first. So all day Tatum has been just off and isolating herself. She's normally a very sweet doe, a very quiet doe, and so I didn't know if she was gonna all of a sudden be loud or something, but that's not happening. She is being very much herself, just trying to isolate. Normally she stays by Tilly and Fern. She doesn't wanna be by them at all. She wants to be off in a corner, and she wants somebody to scratch her. So all day I've been out there kind of comforting her, scratching her, stuff like that. But uh, now we're just trying to hurry, finish up dinner. We can go out there and hopefully deliver some baby goats. I don't think she's quite to the pushing stage yet. What do you think, Lydia? I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, she's not really rolling over and acting agitated just yet. Guys, Tatum is so adorable. This reminds me of, you know, a year and a half ago when she was born. She just looks at you and does that little blink. Are you okay? You're so sweet and so quiet. I barely even knew you were in labor. It's kind of a new thing, huh? You're such a sweetie. All right, Tatum is starting to do a few little pushes here and there. She's very focused, so I'm trying to stay quiet. Okay, guys, it looks like we are in it for a long night tonight. Tatum's, you know, laboring, pushing a little bit. Like here comes a contraction right now. She does a little bit of pushes here and there, but it's definitely slow going, which can totally be normal for first timers. So I'm not worried at all. I got my tea. I'm gonna sit out here and read a book and just wait. Okay. We are pushing hard and hoping that this baby comes out easily. Something dark colored. Something dark colored, we're hoping it is. Hooves. Hooves, at least. <laughs> <laughs> at least hooves, we always hope for that. Better hooves than nose. Good job. Those look like hooves, huh? Yeah. I know, doing good. Get that head out. That's the hardest part. It is. Then after that, you're good. There's the little nose coming out. Yeah. Oh, it's so close. Yeah. Gotta just get that head out. Oh, here we go. You got it. You're doing so good. So good, Tatum. Do it's better stretch. to stretch really slow so it doesn't tear. But like, is the baby okay? The baby's okay. Because oh, yeah, when they come this way, their umbilical cord is <laughs> It's a boy! Oh my gosh! 
<laughs> a buckling. Another boy. First time mom. What is that? Are you gonna lick that? I am not a raincoat here to keep okay. you warm. Then go back in the closet. Amazing. Yeah, after the storm. What to do. I'm not a match simply waiting. It's, a, it's another. <laughs> another boy. Another Jasper boy. Good job, Tatum. You For did. ten years we had like so many girls. She could have another though, guys. She looks yeah, she so. that one's actually not that big. I'm not your impression of a sea wish. You loved more than everything. At least she had it. That was a long time of her just kind of it's so this is what's so crazy is once it's active where she's really really active yeah. that's it happens so fast because yeah. like i called you guys like seven minutes like ten minutes ago and I even, yeah. Let's talk about it. Lydia, let's talk about it. Why? Look, he's starting to take his first steps. He's so strong, strong and <laughs> smart. <laughs> <laughs> he's he is though. He's already up here in like he wants that five milk. seconds. Oh my gosh. She doesn't really know. Oh, it. did you squeeze it and get the plug out? No. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> She's kind of doesn't know what this is like. This is the first time. This is the first time. She's it's ever so made hard. milk, so she's kind of like doesn't know what this. Feels she's doing like. so good though. They get it again. Yeah. Oh well, he's still fishing around a little bit. Yeah, I'll help ya. Here it is. Kevin's a master at this. I help with the delivery and Kevin helps with the latching. There you go, here it is. Oh. Well guys, I've checked three times. <laughs> Still a boy. <laughs> All right guys, that was my night. Four hours of sitting out here with uh, Tatum and getting a little buckling out of it. But um, that's okay. We're just happy everything went smoothly. Tatum has an interesting way that she likes to deliver her babies, <laughs> but uh, she did fine. Are you calling your baby? It's like two feet away from her. That's just too far. Let's see. Get over here. There he is. There he is. Oh my goodness, he is cute. Stay. I see you passed the placenta there, but you didn't eat it, did you? Oh my goodness. Tatum, you've been such a good mama. You're so good. Oh, he's not going to let us see him. Well, look at you. You're adorable. Oh my goodness. He's a lot lighter than little Jasper. He's more of a a gray almost. Oh, he's got a little moon spot down there. See that? Hello. Is that your mama? Well, guys, just a buckling. But it's okay. He's adorable. And I'm glad that Tatum did a good job. That was, you know, you always worry about that a little bit with first timers. You want to make sure that they deliver fine. And she did really great. I mean, having one buckling can be a little bit disastrous because they can sometimes be a little bit too big, but she did a good job. She wanted to deliver standing up, but that's actually a, a Tilly trait, her mom. Her her mom Tilly delivered a uh, hope that way. I just, I just wanna double check. <laughs> yep. You're a little buckling, that's for sure. Oh, he's cute. I know, I don't wanna stress you out. I'm sorry, I just wanna see him. 
You're being such a good mama. Letting him nurse. Just ignore Napoleon. He's over here in this cage, in the far cage, because him and Zora were fighting way too much, and Napoleon's done breeding Daphne and Olive, so we're good with that, but Napoleon has to be over on this side now, <laughs> so he's a little loud. I was just hoping for a Dolene because I really wanted to raise Dolene's up and see how Zoro's daughters do, but we still have Fern, we still have Tilly, so we are going to look forward to that and maybe we'll get some Dolene's out of that, I don't know. Or we'll have six Bucklings and that'll be fine too. Just one Tatum, just one? Yeah. Okay, I do think he is pulled. He has, um, pulled means that they don't have any horns naturally. Let's see if I can get it to focus on him. Let me stand up. He doesn't have the little swirls on his head and he, I know, and he has the skin moves. So I think he is pulled and he's definitely, sorry. He's definitely a lighter chocolate, almost like a gray. Like a mocha. And Tatum has literally the tiniest little udder. <laughs> That's adorable. So we'll see how it develops. It can take a while for them to really develop their full udder. Especially first timers. Sometimes they don't have a lot of milk. Or I mean a lot of volume in the beginning. But usually enough to feed their babies. But they don't really get a ton of volume till later. So we'll have to watch her develop and see how she does. But she's being a really good mom and standing there patiently while he nurses. So she's doing a good job. You are so good. <laughs> You're so cute. Your little face is so cute. This is what they do for the first couple days. Oh, <laughs> and they just nurse and kiss and bond. Get knocked over. <laughs> Get knocked over. And just walk around, experience the world. So cute. You sure are cute. Oh, he's a little dirty. So we've got Jasper one, <laughs> Jasper two. <laughs> their Literally. faces, their faces are similar, but I think he, this one, is more of a like light brown. You yeah, know, right? he is. He yeah, is. Hold them together. I don't know. <laughs> he's got a little bit of reddish brown towards his bottom. He right? does. He does. I swear, Zoro just like. Copy pasted. Yeah. Copy pasted. Oh my gosh. I know. What happened? It's okay. So Fern is due next. We'll see if she has the same. same. Oh man. Another we have boy. like three boys. <laughs> We're gonna be just like this. That's okay. Except Jasper is the one that has the vampire teeth. Yes. See? That's why he is, and he is a vampire. He bites so much. Oh, he does? <laughs> yeah. He's been yes. biting my legs. Hey. Yeah. This one doesn't have any vampire teeth, so yeah. he's not a vampire. All right, guys. Thanks for joining us today. <laughs> that was a fun video. Um, I actually, looking back, think he has a bunch of moon spots all over him, but I think that'll come out more in the next few days. So I hope you guys all have a nice holiday break if you're having a holiday this weekend. And hopefully Fern delivers soon and then we'll have a fun video for that. In the meantime, if you wanna go way back and see the video where Tilly gave birth standing up, go ahead and click right here.